Okay. Hi everyone. Um, I haven't made a video in a really long time and I never even talked about this in my videos because I, well for one I wasn't supposed to and even after I found out I could finally like tell whoever I wanted, uh, I, I was busy. There you go, that's the bottom line. I was busy and I didn't have time so, uh, yeah. So, uh, bottom line is, I was chosen to be in the Life in a Day film, and I'm s still in my hotel room, um, because we're here at Sundance right now, and the premiere for Life in a Day just got over with, um, well, not just now, it was like eight hours ago, or, okay, maybe not that long, like five hours ago, or something like that six hours ago. I, I don't know. Like five hours ago. And, um, so the premiere, uh, it was really, it was intense. And I have bags under my eyes because it is 3.15 a.m. I haven't slept yet and because, you know, you gotta go crazy. I don't know what I'm saying. Um, after the premiere we had the after party, you know, so, uh, there's a lot of dancing, a lot of drinking. I didn't drink. I'm only 20. Uh, a lot of people tried to tell me it was okay, though. <laughs> They're like, oh, yeah, go ahead. You're gonna drink. No. Um, so, there's a lot of dancing and lots of dancing. Um, lots of screaming and laughing and just a genuinely amazing time actually um christopher was playing his ukulele out on the balcony and we were screaming horribly depressing songs and oh it was great <laughs> and um i can honestly say i've had the most amazing time here at the sundance film festival that i've ever had in my entire life this is uh I don't want to sound cliche, but, you know, that's my thing. I like being cliche, so, um, where was I going with this? Um, it's cliche because I, because, what was I saying? I don't even know what I was saying anymore. Is, Oh, it's cliche because I love this experience. Like, this this has been... Like, you can't put something like this into words unless you, like, experience it yourself. Like, you can imagine what it would be like, but then when you, like, well, what the f fudger did I do to my hair? Um, you can think about what it's gonna be like, but you'll... You never... You just don't know. You don't know until you, you really go through it, and then you're, like... Your mind is blown. My mind is blown. But it's not even about like, um, like, you know, having lots of people praise you for something you feel like you didn't even do. Um, it's about meeting all these completely, like, almost perfect people. And I don't mean perfect as in, oh, they're flawless. They're just so, like, without faults or something like that. I mean perfect as in just the most perfect kind of people that I want to surround myself with. Like, you just, you can't put a price on that and everyone I've met through this, I'm just really glad that I met everybody because what am I doing to that bottle? I'm still a little fuzzy in the head because we went to this after party for like three hours or something. It, let's see. I don't even remember when it started, but it, it didn't end until like two, two something. Hmm. So, how was that? I just heard something in my room. Anyway, um, I have a tiny bit of a headache from all the loud music and the 
I'm going to go back to work on Monday and that's about it. <laughs> uh, yeah, maybe I'll, you know, the only thing that's, that's really going to change that I hope changes is I'll get a, a little more monthly views on my uh, page because then I can start making more than just $5 a month <laughs> through Google. Um, but if I don't, that's okay too. I make, I make enough to be content. So, I can pay my bills. I'm good with that. <laughs>